हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी वन एक्सपेरिमेंट विच इज कॉल्ड एज कोविशन ऑफ स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन द एम ऑफ दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट इज टू फाइंड आउट द कोविशन ऑफ स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन बिटवीन ए ब्लॉक एंड द हॉरिजोंटल सर्फेस द एपरेटस रिक्वायर्ड फॉर दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट इज हॉरिजोंटल प्लेन विथ पुली वुडन ब्लॉक विथ ए हुक string weight box scale pan etc in this experiment after reading we are going to calculate the static friction using the formula mu s is equal to p divided by w p is the horizontal force required just to slide the block or we will call that as effort then w is the weight of the block or load we will add on the wooden block so this is the diagram now mahajan sir will demonstrate you the experiment vidyarthi mitranno aaj apan experiment shuru karnar aho this is a inclined plane this is a empty wooden block this is a empty pan we take the first reading we take the first reading empty wooden blocks we weight the 10 gram therefore this 10 gram coefficient of static friction therefore measure the measure the w 0 40 plus 10 which is equal to 50 and therefore pan reading is 13 plus 5 it means 18 18 now second reading we add the 50 gram therefore 40 plus 50 which is equal to 90 therefore the pan of the weight is 20 plus 5 25 plus 13 it means 38 then the third reading add the 100 gram plus 40 it means 140 therefore 13 plus 50 it means 63 p is 63 w is a w is a 140 as mahajan sir have taken the readings we have calculated further calculation and all the observations we have written here these three observations were for w1 10 15 and 100 respectively and then for p1 it was 5 25 and 50 we have given that the weight of empty wooden block is 40 g and the weight of empty pan is 13 g so we have to add w1 plus 40 to get total weight of wooden block so we will add 40 in all these three columns 10 plus 40 is 50 50 plus 40 is 90 100 plus 40 is 140 then similarly we have to add 13 to get total weight of the pan or we will call this as effort so 5 plus 13 is 18 25 plus 13 is 38 and 50 plus 13 is 63 now to get the coefficient of static friction we have to take the ratio of p that is the fifth column to the weight of the wooden block that is the third column so 18 divided by 50 we will get 0.36 similarly 38 divided by 90 is 0.42 and 63 divided by 140 gives us 0.45 so if we calculate the mean we will get 0.36 plus 0.42 plus 0.45 divided by 3 we will get 0.41 that is the coefficient of static friction between wooden block and the plane surface as we have calculated the coefficient of static friction from calculation we can also calculate that from the graph 
so to plot the graph you have to plot p that is effort on y axis that is the vertical axis and you have to put values of load that is the weight on the block along x axis then you will get some straight line and find out the slope of that line the slope of that line is equal to the mu s that is the coefficient of static friction now you can write the result as coefficient of static friction between the two surfaces by calculation is equal to 0.41 similarly you can write another result that is coefficient of the static friction between the two surfaces by graph is equal to whatever you will get the slope now to do this experiment you have to take care of following precautions the two surfaces in contact should be dry and clean another one is the reading must be taken for the weight for which the block is just started moving the pen and string should not touch the table and the last is string should be parallel to the horizontal surface